Okay, so since we were talking about the roll of the top line, Miss Gabby just got a bath. She's not real happy with me, but I'm glad I did it because I found a tick on her forehead. Anyway, so with the top line, right now they are a little high in the rear. That's normal. Um, there's a few things that you can do to kind of minimize it. Right now she has a lot of adult hair growing in up here, so that's difficult to deal with. So you would just kind of scissor it somewhat flat, stay. And over the loin, so since they're high in the rear, you can take this hair a little bit shorter, um, either with a clipper, and you just wanna do it right over directly above the loin because that is where they're arching up when they're moving. Um, and part of that is not gonna be fixable because um, when they move their rear in, it's going to um, elevate the top line a little bit. So you can fluff this. So in the stack, they're gonna look good, but on the move, it's kind of unavoidable to be honest. But as far as the roll, what I have found over the years is it's actually not this hair that's flipping when they move, it's this hair down here. Um, so if you take their underside and you roll it, you will see this hair from the side will flip up and then come down and flip up and come down when they're gating. So what you can do is actually try to thin this a little bit and make this really short by the loin. And that will sometimes help a little bit. I had to do that with Kramer a lot um, because he, had a, he carried a lot of coat here and it would flip up and it would make his top line look soft and it was not. So anyway, that's just kind of a trick. Gabby says, hello. She really doesn't have that big of a nose. Say good job, Susie and Reno. Reno and Susie. Susie Q and Reno showed.